What is up guys, it's Bloodzealous. Welcome to uh, a little bit of a Halloween special. I thought I'd try and get some sort of tutorial going here for Halloween, so we're gonna learn how to build kind of a haunted graveyard theme. I think that would uh, would be quite nice for Halloween, so let's get right into this. What you're gonna wanna do first is find yourself a swamp biome. We're gonna start off by building the walls. Now swamp biome seemed the creepiest to me, and honestly this is 1.7, it doesn't look that much like a swamp, but I don't know. Um, so here's how I'm doing my walls, we're doing stone brick pillars and then cobblestone um, bases, and I spaced it out roughly three per per um, pillar, but I, that last one there's four. It doesn't matter, It's not it doesn't need to be perfect, it's a cemetery. Um, Dead people don't care really, <laughs> really what you do. Um, so we're gonna take our iron bars here and we're gonna drop these in between all the spaces, uh, like so. Here's the entryway. Um, this is just a design I came up with. You can do anything you want for the entrance. This is nice and simple, and I thought it gave it that kind of cemetery gate feel, um, which is kind of spooky and I don't know stuff like that. So we use our half slabs like so, and then we're gonna actually let's get rid of that, and then we're gonna. Um, Put in some some iron bars there and stairs at the bottom. I love giving things feet with stairs. It always looks really nice. Um, so you should end up with something like that, and uh, then you got yourself a nice wall going around. I've left the trees on the inside to give it a more natural feel, and um, what we have is a cemetery. So what we're gonna do first here is build graves. Now, I tried using the new type of dirt because I thought that would look really cool, but the chunk I'm in is on my server. Hey Jasper, the chunk I'm in is on my server, and it's still 1.6.4, even though I'm playing on 1.7, so the dirt didn't work. Um, but you can use that new kind of dirt, or you can just go along with gravel. And then we're using um, stone fences here, like so. And I've just kind of mixed up the uh, mossy stone walls and normal stone just to give it a kind of uh, older feel. Put in a couple more graves here, um, and you can really put them wherever you want. Just drop them in like this, and there's multiple designs to graves, but that's what I like doing. Uh, over here we're going to make a little pond. Seemed fitting for a cemetery, like I don't know if you want to go cry yourself a pond. Because, I don't know. <laughs> Guys, it makes sense, don't question me. Um, but anyways, we'll make ourselves a little pond here. And it's got a gravel bottom, which is already nicely put there by my world edit skills. Uh, fill that up with water. You guys should have expected a pond, come on, you know me. Um, so we'll just drop that in. We want this to be a little bit spookier though, we don't want it to look just like a nice cemetery. So, we're gonna put in some nether rack, uh, just in a couple random places. We'll put it right next to this lovely wooden tree and hope it doesn't light on fire. Um, so, and then I guess we'll put some over here and one in this corner. This will act as our lighting. I tried redstone torches, but it just didn't quite look right. Um, so this will be our lighting, some burning stuff. As you can see, I really like the vines, by the way, coming off the trees. we got vines everywhere. The vines are great. Over here, this is just kind of random. Um, kind of, I don't know, you could call like a memorial little statue thingy. There's really, I don't know what it is, it just gave me a reason to put something in that corner. Put more skulls and everything. So, we're just gonna drop down a couple uh, stone walls and put both normal skeleton and wither skeleton heads on them. That'll look nice. And then I guess if we want to um, kind of make it like a shrine, we could try uh, putting in a flower pot with some flowers. And again, I couldn't use the new flower because the chunk I'm in is still in 1.6, even though the game I'm in is 1.7, if that makes any sense, because I'm on a server and it's not happy with me. So we'll put in a couple flowers, kind of like a shrine. It's still getting a little spookier, but not quite. Take out your cobwebs. Of course we need cobwebs. This is like the number one item that's gonna represent Halloween in Minecraft, right? So I just kind of went around and scattered cobwebs everywhere because I was random. I'd like to take this time now to ask everyone to leave a like if you enjoyed the Halloween special. It's not over yet, but because I have nothing to say for the next 10 seconds while I place cobwebs because I'm commentating over this, you can leave a like because that's all I have to say. So yeah, I'm just gonna drop some cobwebs and it looks like we're about to move on to the next step, which is just great. Uh, lastly, put a couple more skulls in the front and bone meal. Oh yeah, you knew that was coming too, right? Bone meal. What better way to make it look overrun than to drop in it your bone meal? Just like that. And now what you have is a nice overrun small little cemetery design. You can make it in obviously f like five minutes or so. Um, and it really looks quite nice. You can make it bigger, smaller, do whatever you want, add on whatever you want to make it look a little bit creepier. But it's really up to you. And uh, you got yourself a cemetery. I'm gonna make a quick gravel path here. The one problem with this is that the gravel matches the graves and it's a little confusing. Um, that's why I wish I had you been able to use the other kind of dirt, the pro... pro... I'm done. Whatever it's called. The new kind of dirt. But yeah, we'll just make a gravel pathway right there. Uh, give you a way to get to the pond and stuff. I didn't want this to look like a run-down cemetery, just more like a normal cemetery, because cemeteries are always creepy, right? 
So um, it's not technically a rundown cemetery, it's just kind of normal. Anyways though guys, that is a quick way to make yourself a creepy haunted like cemetery in Minecraft. I'm sure I missed something that would make it better, um, so if you want to add that in, feel free to go ahead. Leave a like if you enjoyed this guys, I'd love to uh, get more kind of building tip videos up, even though this wasn't technically a building tip, so it was close enough. And have an awesome Halloween if you're watching this before you go trick or treating. Save me some candy, I'm a fatty.